Over a dozen states are considering legislation. That would make it illegal for trans and gender non-conforming people to use the bathroom of their choice. People want to keep single-sex facilities for some very strange reasons. They want to protect the sanctity of the bathroom. They're concerned that sharing paper towels will expose their children to dangerous alternative lifestyles. <gasps> To be perfectly honest, we think all these anxieties are a little silly. There are far more serious concerns affecting our public bathrooms. Here are a few things we're, we're worried, worried about. about. Witnessing someone walking out the bathroom without washing their hands. Please stop. Somebody walking into the bathroom when you're trying to cry in peace. Oh. People seeing you through a slit in the door. Seriously, it's like the eye of Sauron. Like, I always I look, look at, at the him. shoe. I look oh. like. I always look at this shoe. <laughs> what if the ghost of a former Hogwarts student is in the bathroom? Having only one small bit of toilet paper and having to strategically plan just how you'll use it. Getting changed in a stall and then all of your nice clothes fall to the urine-soaked floor. Having no paper towels and being forced to use those air dryers that were installed in like 1832. Wondering who in the room made that noise and then realizing, oh, it's you. <laughs> when the geese is wild. <laughs> <laughs> the gymnastics of trying to hold the bathroom stall door while you're doing your business. If someone tries to open it anyway. <laughs> Candidates, pay attention. Rebuild America's public bathroom infrastructure. Don't waste your time on transphobic bathroom bills. Don't build walls, build bathroom stalls. Worry about things that matter. <laughs> Huge orgy <laughs> right next to a public urinal. <laughs>